Hey guys, GTAD Zealot here, coming at you with another episode of Imperium Galactic Survival. So, this is episode 6, I believe, 6 of the um, Dawn of Galaxy series that I've been running. This is uh, season 1. Uh, basically, I'm trying to do the Dawn of the Galaxy scenario without dying 100 times. And here's currently my stats. Um, so I am level 10. I've killed four things and have not actually died yet. So I'm, I'm really proud of that stat. The deaths at zero, that's, that's pretty good. I've got a base up and going. I've got an SV up. And I, I mean, yes, this is not really a, this is a starter SV. It's barely, it can fly, but if you spit at it, it will fall apart. So um, even though I put four rocket launchers on it, it's it's more like a glass cannon. It has a lot of bite, a lot of bite, but it can't take a hit. So what I've been doing um, off camera is I just prepped, got some stuff together. I made some, there it is, it's just finishing its last one. Made a couple of hundred rockets for the rocket launchers, just in case. Gathered up um, some more oxygen, had some more bottles out in the oxygen generator, which was fantastic. Uh, so we're just going to grab all this stuff. I made a whole bunch more Promethium fuel packs, and I'm actually going to make a couple more just to leave at the base, just in case the base craps out for some reason. Fuel packs in the uh... anyway. Okay. Yeah, call me paranoid, but uh, it happens. So I've got food, I've got energy, I've got oxygen. Oh, let's make sure I've got what I need for my drill. So um, six biofuel. That's probably going to be enough. I'm, I'm all I plan on doing is going up there, getting some neo, getting some sath, and coming back. I need the neo to get the tier two stuff. I need, I need a little bit of Neo to spawn my HV because I stupidly put a really expensive thruster on the buck and, and uh, didn't um, blueprint it before I did that. Anyway, needless to say, I gotta get up there, I gotta get some Neo, gotta get some Sath. Not much, just enough to get me to the next step. So that's our goal today. We're gonna fly to the moon. It may even has a moon. If it doesn't, we could be screwed. Okay, so let's power it up. We're going to go into the control panel with P. We're going to take a look at all our stats. I noticed that there was no damage on it. Um, last episode, I got attacked by a bunch of drones. Um, hopefully... Hopefully they take off when I leave the play field and they don't attack my base. That's, I'm hoping for that anyway. So, having said that, let's put our snacks away. We're gonna get um, the missiles in there. We got 200 missiles now. 1,950 mil bullets and 200 missiles. We can go for six hours at idling so we're we're golden we're golden we've got full oxygen let's go, let's go. so we head out i prefer third person view guys or if you like first person view but i prefer third person so easy exit that's just what i wanted um i'm gonna lower the view of the ship a bit just by any page up a couple of yeah page up to lower the ship well it's Cursor's moving up, okay? I just want to take a closer look at over here. Now, I could go crazy and start shooting a bunch of stuff, uh, but personally, I don't want to unless it's one of those golems. Um, I don't really need the food. Okay, now, wasn't there another big... Yeah, see, there's another base in behind. Can I get, yeah, the armory behind there? The armory has turrets, I'm pretty sure, so I'm just going to stay below. Okay, so we can, we could visit 
this training station, I guess it went one and two. But I don't want to. I want to go to the moon. So let's go. Just going to fly up out of the atmosphere. SV is another really good way of exploring. field that you're in because you can travel, the SV is the fastest vehicle in the game, either in atmosphere or, or in orbit. Oh, pink, pink and blue, okay, so am I, am I, am I up, I'm up, I'm up, what's that, what's that, what's that over there, something's over
I can't get out of my ship when it's cooking hot like that. Okay. Uh, well, we could come back here later. Sathium, cobalt, copper. Um, let's. Oh, there's the seam there. I don't want to necessarily. Should I fly straight up? Fly to the north? Since I'm facing that direction, let's, let's do that. Zero, I 
wasted a full... Okay, so... <sighs> That's one thing I don't like, is... Uh, with the... With the drill... Um, and I believe the chainsaw... And anything else... Like the multi-tool... reload it like throws everything you have away in it which doesn't make sense because do that you're just trying to top it up right I mean you can do that with um
So sorry about that, guys. Life gets in the way sometimes. Oh, oh yeah, I'm back. Sorry. That was a, a dangerous detour out in the middle of the moon. Okay. I'm sorry, my dog is in a lap. Yappy little guy that won't shut up. Trooper, stop. 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 Stop.
Okay. Let's try and find this. Even with the looted CPUs, I think I can. I think I can make my T2 drill and spawn the HV. so dark. 
can't really see it. Yet I have to because it's too hot during the day. Oh yeah, there's a bunch of Neo down there. Let's pick it up. Get it, 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 get it all. Okay, good. surviving. We are surviving. Oh, it's just so hard to see anything. I need to get me some of those uh, night vision goggles sooner than later, somehow or another. Maybe one of those POIs will have some. Maybe that'll be my next thing I try and do. Because this is just... Really, I mean, come on, look. This is so wild. that I need to get more resources really is what is what I'm trying to do. Pick up all this. Can't even tell what's what's I can't even tell at all. I'm just clicking on whatever. Okay. So I'll do full biofuel work. Let's see what we get out of it. She just rocks tumbling. Let me see what I'm doing. I do have to stop and try and pick up the rocks though, because they will despawn eventually.
I can't tell. I can't tell if there's more. There's a slight buzz of drones in the background, so I'm expecting any moment for the red dots to show up on my screen on the on the uh, radar. disorientated. Um, where's all the stones going? I, I can't see anything. What the hell's going on here? Oh, here we go. No more, no more, no more. Oh, right there. Okay. That's it. Jump back in our ship. You know what? I'm just gonna lift up into orbit here. Right away. So only SVs and capital vessels can <clears throat> freely launch into orbit and fly around. HVs can't at all. If you uh, if you undock an HV in space, it does nothing. It just sits there. Okay, so that's the other moon. So that might be the easier one to go to next time. side of this moon. So what did we get for Neo? 110. That's not bad. That'll give us 220 ingots, which will give us a whole bunch of like advanced CPU. So, so rock. We're ready to go home. So that was successful. Now, as long as we don't die trying to get home you need a warp drive to travel to a location outside your sector okay um i'm not trying to maybe i'm hitting the edge of the play field okay so there's may I think I'll try the other moon next time because that was kind of prohibitive. Um, I don't think I have any other boosts. In fact, I know I don't because I haven't been to any POIs. So I guess what I need to do is get my HV up and going, get my tier two tools up and going and go loot me some POIs. And, um, and yeah, try and uh, try and get some boosts or or better armor or something. And we might even be able to once I get my HV up and running, I might be able to continue on the storyline. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Really? Really? Crap. Let's go after this guy first. He's coming in fast. It's my range 700.
got him in the cockpit or something. What the hell was that? Why can't I move? Oh, I am now, okay. actually right near my base so oh hey look at this We're, oh so there's a PO 
eye down there with turrets on it. I don't want to deal with that right now. I don't want to deal with that. Not this ship. That is a residential complex. Good to know. Good to know. I'm going to just fly close to it. Oh, it's one of those excavation sites. Right. Right. Don't want to deal with it. Discovering resources. Good, good, good. And what is that? Survivor's camp? Oh my god, we're going to have to go check that out. I just want to get back to base. And that'll, that'll make for a great episode. Survivor's camp. Huh. I didn't know that they had that in the um, Dawn of Galaxy scenario. Or is that where I started from? Did I? Yes. I grabbed my stuff and booked it into the water, right? No, I'm, no, it's all just a blur. But we can go back and multi-tool it. Okay, we should be getting close now. Here's our little lake. Here's our little lake. There we go. And stuff's floating in the air. Oh, isn't that terrific? I can't see squat. So. There's the landing pad. Whoa. Straighten it up. Fly right. our base all filled in still. What? Really? No. What? what? where the episode ends uh, we'll get back to this guys for some reason my base is completely buried again <sighs> I'm thinking bug cuz this is single player <laughs> there's not gonna be an admin that would have done that um, I'm thinking okay um, Let's just log off in my ship in the water. That's fine. So, next episode, we'll try and suss this out. This is just weird. If you like this episode, like and subscribe. And I will see you guys next episode.